represent the folding tables and stools. And um, well, since, let's say, some years, we, um, we are working on this furniture, uh, but like in the tradition as architects, you know, architects make a building and then they need something more. They need a table, they need a chair. In this case, um, it was actually, yeah, that started in Brussels. We knew already that it should travel to, um, to London. And then later it continued to Johannesburg and uh, later on to Bordeaux in France. So we needed furniture that could be it could yeah, fold, that could travel, that could, uh, and, uh, and we start to think about it more, to develop it. Um, and also color at a certain moment. We are, well, we are interested in color in a, some, in a specific way. Uh, maybe a kind of, um, like we are, are interested in, in numbers and proportions, very precise proportions. We have our own, own system of proportions by, based on three, five and seven. And the tables and the chairs, they are precisely designed like that, also the thickness of the material. But also we are developing a color system, a kind of catalog of colors that has a uh, a kind of mathematical rela relation one to the other one. It's still under development at the moment. But it seems to be that the green and the blue yeah. will be present somewhere in this color system. Yeah, uh, always on the surfaces. The blue and the green are like water plains and landscape. prairies. And always they are on top of it, of something. No, um, yeah, that's, that's, it's um, our, our fascination for, you know, painting in a way also. At the moment we used to use the uh, NCS color system, because this was a very refined color system where we could actually choose where the, uh, quite a large range of colors, but now we want to pick certain colors and combine these and it's in the combination that we expect that things will happen. In, in a particular kind of structure, we never would use that color between the other one, it has to fit in some structure and we are working on this system. Well, making buildings is, is well, very, a lot of structure, a lot of material, but color can at the end be the fluidum through the building, kind of leading uh, you through a building, like, like yeah, some, some nearly immat immaterial presence that brings you through spaces. But, but, uh, yeah. but it's also, the thing where you're absolutely free to choose doesn't need to be flat or doesn't need to be don't need to be sitting on it or so it's kind of moment where as an architect you can make free choices well it started i think in the in the concert hall of bruges we did um, and well, we were working on that building, which is yeah, serious presence in Bruges in a beautiful historical city, a modern building. Uh, but then at that, at that moment, we got this book of, of the use of colors of Le Corbusier, Polychromie Architecturale. Uh, not that we use these colors, no, but we, we saw this rows of colors next to the other one and then we learned that that that, that, that has a beautiful name uh, 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 in english a color piano and 
in, 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 uh, in German, Farbenklavier. And that was like music for us. I says, I says, we have to... And then we started to bring colors in this building, in the, um, in the banisters, in the balustrades, rows, rows of colors, and the walls, in the, in the interior of the, in, of the hall also. And uh, it, it was, we developed a, a kind of, you know, the outside of the building is reddish, completely earth color by terracotta, terracotta ceramic. And we analyzed that color, uh, the, the specific number of that color by, and then we, we, we were looking for the reverse color for the, the contrasting color, which seemed, you had the reddish, but which seemed like a greenish, bluish color. Uh, you have the, and then we analyzed that color again in different colors, because in the, in the, we picked out, out of that, of that greenish, bluish color, very specific colors. Uh, so that we had, then we had a kind of series of seven colors. And we worked with these colors in, in, in specific rows, like, like a, a path, like a, a walk through the building. And these colors are like next to you, leading you through the building. And also in the interior of the, of, the, of the hall itself, of the music room itself, um, is, is with these colors also. Like, and it looks like a little bit like music, I have to say. I, I, I don't know, but to my opinion, it looks like a bit of music. He's the boss, simply. That's true. No, he's leading. Now you know the relation. <laughs> he, says, the he says, Papa, relation. today. <laughs> no, it's true. Why not? No, we, well, we, will, we, we, uh, we talk, and we communicate, in and direction. in a big direction, we have the same direction and ideas. Um, but we are father and son, so we have our uh, wars. <laughs> <laughs> And sometimes we don't, and we hope there are more of those than of the wars. But uh, no, it, it works fine. But uh, now it seems to be kind of strategic, strategic choice to work with other generations, as more where it is more kind of. It's not a coincidence, but a meeting between people who are more or less alike. No, no, it's not new. It's it's the thing moment at the moment. It's finished with the one architect. It's it's a group work. It's it is like that. It changed completely.